Are evil gnomes real? Stay tuned to find out. Across different times and places, people have shared stories about mischievous gnomes, small creatures with a tricky and sometimes wicked nature that have captured imaginations worldwide. Welcome to Strange Lore. If you are a fan of the mysterious and unusual, please subscribe to join the expedition. Today we will discuss several examples of these creepy and mysterious creatures. One well-known tale comes from German folklore, featuring the Hainzel Mansion. These tiny gnomes are famous for helping with household chores in the night. But, when curious humans try to uncover their identities, the gnomes turn vengeful, disappearing and leaving chaos behind, refusing to aid the household again. In Scandinavian myths, the Nisi, a gnome-like creature, is known for both kindness and anger, usually seen as a protector of farms, ensuring the well-being of livestock and crops. The Nisi can become malevolent if not treated respectfully. Farmers who forget to leave a bowl of porridge for the Nisi during Christmas might face ruined harvests or misfortune with their animals. Irish folklore introduces the leprechaun, a gnome linked to mischief and trickery. While often seen as harmless, leprechauns have a reputation for leading unsuspecting humans astray, earning a place in the darker side of folklore. They have been known to use lies and illusions, distracting humans while they get away or sending them into dangerous situations to protect their gold. In a different historical setting, the idea of malevolent gnomes continues, going beyond Deras and Kiltires. Yeah, okay, thanks for that. What he said was, in a different historical setting, the idea of malevolent gnomes continues, going beyond eras and cultures. Thanks, Bella. Your translation was appreciated. A 17th century Swedish folktale, the Tunbrads Runkir, features sinister gnomes with a love for mischief. Believed to inhabit dark corners of households, especially where bread was baked, these gnomes would wreak havoc if a household failed to leave freshly baked flatbread for them. The gnomes would become vengeful, their response creating mischief and causing disruptions in the daily life of the household, fostering an atmosphere of unease. The stories about evil gnomes from various cultures show how these mischievous creatures keep us curious and teach us a thing or two along the way. Hello explorers, this is Bella Ravenheart from Strange Lore. If you are a fan of the strange and mysterious, check out my channel as we cover many different strange and unusual topics. Touch the raven down below to subscribe or click the box on the left for the next episode. Hurry, time is running out.